Hey, Chimicum 6th graders. What a weird way to end your 6th grade year. You know, I'm sorry that this is happening. Um, Governor has closed us down this year, and we're going till June 19th. So let's uh, catch you up on what's going on. I hope you had a great spring break, um, you know, as well as you can. Hope you enjoyed Easter. Uh, but here's what I want you to be checking on. Now that we're back and we're going all the way till June 19th. First thing is, if you go over to Messages, if it's like this without the green dot, you're good. You're all caught up. Uh, if you see a green dot here, you got a message from me. Read what it says, and you can respond. We can stay in touch that way really easily. If all you have is a phone on data, it doesn't take that much data at all to communicate. The biggest thing we're going to get back into the swing of is uh, around 10 a.m. I will be doing every day a random event Monday through Friday. By about 6 or 7 or sometime in the evening, I will deal with whatever, you know, if it was damage, if I want to see who won something to get XP and gold, it'll be dealt with in the evening. Um, if you look at your messages and the dot is still green. You have to go up, scroll up because you miss stuff. It will only go away once you've gotten to the top and seen everything. So if you haven't checked in a while, this will give you a chance to see, oh my goodness, look at all I've missed. Wow. Ooh, Mr. G's mage is looking good. And there's that new pet. I like that little alligator guy. He goes well with my mage here. Level 12, by the way. We got a couple of level 12s already. Um, this shows you, yeah, everything that we did up until spring break. So that's your first thing. Check here. Second thing is, check your quests. There's been a bunch of updates and uh, new things going on. But if you haven't done the hydrodynamics check-in, and even if you've done it, go back to the flip grid. Uh, because if you haven't done it, do it. And if you've done it, uh, you, if you haven't read what I wrote, read. <laughs> you don't have to read it. It was a video. If you haven't watched the video, because I gave everybody uh, a video back just to confirm that I got your message. So go ahead and log in with your school Google account. Because it's not just seeing what I uh, said. When you're here, uh, you can see who responded to you. But notice what Sequoia found out. You can also reply to each other. Again, we may be physically distant and we may be in our homes, but uh, you can still stay connected through Flipgrid like this. So if you hear somebody like maybe one of these people is your teammate, it's like, hey, I'm at that same stage too. Let's finish up together. Uh, so this is a way you can stay connected with each other, especially if you have questions. Uh, you can ask each other. So Flipgrid is one cool way to stay connected. Another cool way is I'm trying to add to every quest assignment uh, a discussion forum. And you can use this to type a comment or reply to somebody's comment. And again, this is another way you can communicate with each other throughout space and time. It doesn't have to be at the same time or in the same uh, house, but yet you can communicate. The only trick is you got to come back and check and see if somebody responded to you after you replied to them or after you posted something. Same thing with the PSA. I opened up the discussion forum. So all these uh, assignments have instructions, and I've got a bunch of videos to help you do those. But if you still have a question, message me here, and let's pick a time in Zoom. I want to Zoom every Wednesday at 11. For anyone who's available, check the message here. 
go to class announcement. I'll post a link to the Zoom. If you need the phone number, you can call in from a landline or your phone. Again, very low data. But you can at least ask questions. If other students are there, you can say hi to each other. If you have video turned on, you can see each other and wave to each other. I'll just uh, unmute you and let you talk and ask questions, and we can check in. I'll do that every Wednesday at 11. But your goal this week, this week here, the 13th through the 17th, is to finish your public service announcement. So let's get the hydrodynamics challenge and public service announcement done. Uh, because next week, we're starting climate change. I've got a lot of great stuff for you. And I've recorded videos for each step. And you can see here, these uh, are the quests that you will be unlocking once we start that. I kind of disconnected it there, but I will reconnect it this coming weekend. And you'll start with Think Like a Scientist and work your way through climate change, ACE DOT, and ocean acidification. In the meantime, if you've done GIMKit, I added some more uh, GIMKits for you to play. So I've got an Earth Science one, a Science Olympiad, Climate Change, Light Energy, and Atoms. And then the bonus is create one. Share it with me, and if it's good, I'll post it here. Same thing with Kahoot. I've got a whole bunch of good cahoots here on ecosystems, human impacts on the environment, forces and energy, roller coasters. That's a good one. And atoms. Uh, play it over and over again. Try the new ones. Make one of your own then. On, on a science topic, climate change would be great because that's what we're going to study. Uh, water pollution would be great because that's what we're finishing this week. And uh, if it's good, I'll share it on here. And then don't forget the Legends of Learning. I've got some great playlists there. All the instructions are here. Uh, and it's on Google Classroom. So if you go to Google Classroom, you'll see this one. The Science Games one. It has the instructions. And you'll also see the one I posted on the old island, the Starship Equinox. So I've got two different types of playlists. Some of the games are the same, some are different, but please play them. Play as many of them as you can and let me know which ones are the best to teach you something and fun at the same time. I want to know from you. So yeah, that's where we're at this week. Uh, if you have any questions, we can Zoom any time we're both available. We'll just make an appointment or you can check in Wednesdays at 11. Uh, I'd love to see you because, yeah, we're in quarantine till June.